back to another really bladed boxy charm unboxing. You guys probably started to assume that I must have cancelled it, given how long it's been since I've posted one of these, but no, it's more that they don't label what month they're from, so if I fall behind, suddenly I'm like, I don't know for sure what came from what month, and then getting really behind, I'm like, oh boy, okay, let me see if I can try to figure it out. So these may or may not even be correct, but the one that was holding everything up is the one I couldn't find what the fuck I did with it. And I finally found it this morning. So before I lose it again, we're unboxing it so I can start using this stuff because it is from July. <laughs> it's from fucking July. And it was the Norvina Anastasia Beverly Hills uh, BoxyCharm Premium Box. So it had a coupon for 50% off it on a or Anastasia Beverly Hills.com, but I've just I'm not shopping from there, so. I do have a little thing with values and info on the stuff here, but yeah, here was the card. Um, I'm just gonna, in no particular order, pick stuff up from the box. So first thing in here is the Anastasia Beverly Hills Dewy Set Setting Spray, which, um, let's see here. This retails for... $26, which is about on par with what I pay for the big size of the Tarte setting spray that I use, so that's alright, whatever. Um, Dewy Set Setting Spray by Anastasia Beverly Hills is a coco fuck, coconut vanilla scented setting spray that seamlessly blends products together as it sets makeup, leaving the complexion with a dewy, never oily, radiant finish. This gentle mist is ideal for those with dry skin or for those who want to achieve the ultimate dewy glow. Well, it's coconut scented, but it doesn't have actual coconut in it. Oh no. Oh no. Let's see. If it does, it's gotta be hiding in the fragrance. So, I'll at least give it a try on a day off in case I do have a reaction. But, oh, that's. Man, that really sucks, because that's, like, really good stuff. Man, why is it gotta be coconut? Damn it to hell. Why do I have to be allergic to coconut? Fuck. Anyway, so that's that. Uh, next thing in here is the Anastasia Beverly Hills Loose Setting Powder. Uh, it's a big old thing of it. Let's see here. This retails for $38. Perfect, er, <laughs> perfect. English is hard! <laughs> Perfect, brighten, and set makeup in place with loose setting powder by Anastasia Beverly Hills. This lightweight, super fine powder formula goes on smoothly as it absorbs oil, minimizes shine, and leaves you with a flawless matte finish. The silky formula gives the complexion a seamless, soft focus effect, blurs the look of imperfections, and extends the wear of your makeup. There's that. We've also got the loose highlighter. Ooh, what color is it? Vegas. Ooh, what color is Vegas? Let's uh, see. Ooh, she's so sparkly. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. I should have expected it to be a gold. Like, I'm not even mad. That is honestly really pretty, and it's nice and pa Ooh, it's holographic on the bottom! It does not take much to make my day. It really doesn't. It really doesn't. Just make something sparkly and or holographic. If you get both, then, ooh, you just made my day for real. So, okay. Oh my god, the phone. We'll wait! It probably won't leave a message anyway. If it starts to, I'll hit stop, but... Ah... Uh. Come on, phone. Why do you do this to me every time I record? Hello. Please leave a message after the phone. My point exactly. No message. Anyway, so for the loose highlighter, it retails for 25 bucks. Loose Highlighter by Anastasia Beverly Hills is a shimmering loose highlighter powder with highly reflective iridescent pearls that deliver an intensely sparkly payoff. This easy-to-blend formula has a soft velvety texture and leaves you with a silky finish. Like a loose powder version of ABH's Glow Kits, this finely milled, lightweight formula allows for buildable coverage so that you can create everything from subtle luminosity to dramatic high-reflect looks. Bum, bum. So we have that. 
We have the Brow Definer Triangular Brow Pencil in Soft Brown. And this retails for $23. Brow Definer by Anastasia Beverly Hills is an all-in-one triangular tipped retractable pencil to define detail and fill in eyebrows. Featuring three different sized edges. Ooh. This pencil delivers ultimate application versatility with ease while the custom spoolie, I almost said spoodle, spoolie and blends for a natural looking finish. Three different sized ends. Let's see it. So I'm having a hard time envisioning what they're talking about here. Oh, okay. So it's kind of like a wedge shape, but okay. Oh, okay. I, I understand what they're saying. Okay. So that's what it looks like. But they mean like boom, boom, boom. Alright, okay. That's cool. So let's put that back in here for now. That's definitely usable. Then we have the... A30 Pro Brush Domed Kabuki Brush. Ooh, $24. A30 Pro Brush by Anastasia Beverly Hills is a medium-sized round brush with firm synthetic fibers ideal for blending emollient-based products with medium to full coverage on the face and body. So, do they mean, like, foundation? Or... I'm confused. <laughs> I'm very confused. Explain what you mean. And then I think there's only one more thing in here. Let's... Oh my goodness. Ah! But it's the thing I'm the most excited for, so... It's in a protective box inside a box. And this is the... Where is it? Norvina Pro Pigment Palette... Palette of Volume 1. And this retails for $60. It's a big old palette. So let's take her out and look at her. See, now she's going to be pretty. I did have a choice between two different ones. And I chose, but I felt it's the better one. Oop. Okay, we have a big old honking mirror. So I'm going to cover that up with the box. I'm going to take off the little film so it doesn't reflect in the light. But these are hella pretty. Oh, I'm stoked to play with these. Oh my goodness. Look at these. Oh my goodness. You know I love the vibrant stuff. So I'm like, oh hell yes. Yes. Queen. Okay. Oh, if I weren't already in the middle of reviewing a big ass palette, I would like dip into this immediately. But I'm trying to like work my way through that one. But this may be my next one after I finish that. Because this is exciting, guys. Like, oh my goodness. And there's lots of pinks and purples to play with, which makes me quite happy. So let's stick it back in for now. Was it this way? Or yeah, okay. And then I will read the little thingy about it. Carefully curated by Norvina herself, the Anastasia Beverly Hills Norvina Pro Pigment Palette Volume 1 is a professional-grade artistry palette featuring 25 deluxe-sized high-performance shades with maximum payoff. Expand your Norvina collection with this limited-edition pro palette and create your most artistic looks yet. Okay, so it's one with A2, A3, A5, B1, B3, B4, B5, C4, C5, D2, D3, D4, D5, E1, E2, E4, and D5 are not intended for use around the immediate eye area. Gotta love when they do that, right? It's like eyeshadow, but don't use it immediately around your eyes. But to my understanding, it just means, like, don't use it in your friggin' waterline, essentially, but, like, you can use it on your lids and stuff, so. Anyways. So that was what was in this box, a lot of good stuff, all of which I'm excited to use, except possibly that setting spray if it fucks with me. But anyways, so that's what I got in my July box. Hopefully I will get back on track and catch back up with all of the backlog of boxes that need to be opened, because I think, as they've been coming in, I've been making a point of labeling them since, I think, November. But everything between July and November, I've kind of had had to guess, judging by the subreddit for, um, for Moxie Charm, and just trying to gauge from there what I think are each one, so I might not be 100% correct, 
but it's gonna have to do. <laughs> so anyways, that's it for this one guys. So as usual, you know what to do. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a like. If you're not already and you'd like to be, click subscribe, hit that notification bell icon so you never miss an upload. Leave comments down below. Make sure you're following my social media accounts, my Facebook fan page, my Twitter, my Instagram, my Etsy, everything and more. It's all down below. And if you like what I do here on this channel and you'd like to help support it, the donation link as always is down in the description. Anyway guys, until next time, see ya.